Let's go and welcome back everybody to Magical Hero and Natsuki Saves the Literature Club. This is episode 4, so if you missed the other 3 parts, I would highly recommend tuning in to those, especially if you're wondering why the hell I'm dressed like a woman right now. You can get that answer at episode 3, part 3, so just go back one episode if you're curious about that. Um, this will be the last video that I'm, I'm in this outfit though, in, in case you, you don't like it, or if you do like it, let me know if you're sad, I'll bring it back again. But uh, yeah. This is part four. Um, if you want a quick summary as to what's kind of went down, pretty much me and Natsuki are on a journey to uh, create a happy ending for the Literature Club. This takes place after the original game ended and Natsuki now has Monika powers and we're going back in time to try to fix what was wrong. Curing Suri's depression, helping Yuri not cut her, I have no idea. All I know is we're trying to help Suri right now. That's like what our, our main goal and objective is. So uh, yeah. That's what we're doing, we're getting down to business, but what we did just do at the end of last episode was we wrote a poem. We had to recite the poem that we originally did in the game so we could figure out who we spent time with. And uh, spoilers, it was Natsuki. And Natsuki is about to see that we hung out with Natsuki in Doki Doki Literature Club. So let's see what Natsuki thinks about us hanging out with Natsuki. Let's go! <laughs> what a absolute janky mouthful of an introduction. If you're still with me, thank you. I appreciate it, soldier. Let me know. Salute to you. But, uh, you were hanging out with... Uh, me. N not that I forgot or anything. <laughs> I guess I just realized looking back how little time you were spending with anyone else. Mm. Anyways. The sexual tension on the rise, baby! Let's go. Right, you should probably hang on to this. Sure. Who knows, maybe it'll come in handy. Yeah, we probably won't find anything else though. Let's try one of the other days. Okay, all right, we're jumping back to another different day. So, so far we have done Wednesday, which was just then. And um, we also technically did Sunday. Sunday was when Yori confessed that she loved us. We told her we are just going to be friends. And then Natsuki was like, yo, hold up. We should probably get more information before we continue this. So I'm assuming it probably wants us to go in a pretty linear fashion. But we can't completely conform. So we're going to skip Thursday for now and jump to Friday. Let's see what happens. We're outside of the club room. I can hear voices coming from the room. Wait, I think someone's leaving. Oh, is this the Yuri incident? Quick, over here. We duck around a corner where we can get a good view of the hallway without being seen. Oh! It's Yori. <laughs> baby. Baby, please! She looks back at the door for a moment, then starts walking away. Quickly head down. I'm going after her. It'd be best to let her alone for some time. Let's see, in the original mod, nobody went after her, yeah? Wait, when, when did this happen? I'm trying to think about when this happened. When did Siori leave the club room by herself? The two days before... This would be the third poem writing... I gotta do some, like, deep brain dives for this. I was not expecting this. When did Siori leave alone? I don't remember this. The, the only person I remember leaving alone was Yori, and then we rushed after her and we saw her slit her wrists. Siori. She definitely wasn't going to get, like, cupcakes, tea, cookies, no way. Though if she would, she probably could. Or if she could, she probably would. I don't know. I, I, just go after her. Just go after her. Natsuki seems to understand, but doesn't follow. She didn't say anything to me at this time, so it wouldn't make sense for me to be there. I'll keep my distance. Oh, interesting. She... We smart, Natsuki. This good play, good play. Again, we don't want to disrupt the, 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 the timeline here. Just be careful, okay? Interesting. All right, this is like new lore. I'm so curious as to what's going to happen by us like having a side conversation with her that normally didn't happen. I run down a bunch of similar looking hallways until I finally catch up to her. She doesn't even realize that I'm here until I call her name out. Siori, wait a second. 
Oh, oh shit. <clears throat> I've done only Natsuki's voice this entire mod so far. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh, Roar. I, I thought I told you to stay with the others. You'd better be careful. I've got a cold and you can catch it. You won't be able to go to the festival. Siori. I didn't realize. Sorry. <laughs> Hope you feel better soon. Jesus Christ. You, uh, you kind of want to know what happens, though, don't you? I'm not going to click it, trust me. I'm not that much of a scumbag. But you do kind of want to know, don't you? Saber. Maybe we'll come back to it. But for now, again, we're, we're, we're going to choose what we want here. Um... That's bullshit, and you know it. What's going on here? I'm a little worried about you. Are you sure there's nothing that you'd like to talk about? I mean, this, this is a little, little, little too aggressive, to be honest. Yeah, a, a little worried? I, I, I think that's good. So his expression breaks a bit. Rar, thanks. I appreciate it, I really do. I'm just tired, and... I don't feel like talking about it right now. I just want to go home and be by myself for a bit, okay? Okay. Well, if you change your mind and want to talk, you know you can get a hold of me. Sorry, I know I was supposed to let you handle this, but I'm pretty sure that's what you would have said, right? Yep. So he smiles at me. By the way, th th if, if this is your first time watching too, th it's constant fourth wall breaks of like, like we are also here, us, Alec. I goes rar the boy, the man, the woman in the in the shoes, and then we got main character too. It's a, it's a deadly duo, they say. So he smiles back at me, and it feels genuine. We wave goodbye, and she walks back home. I would love if there was more of like 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 um. I, well, I guess it's technically dual question answering. Like technically, I answered one question, then MC answered the next question. Okay, that's kind of cool. I, I I like that we're the deadly duo here. Hopefully, that was what was good though i don't think it was to be honest well i guess it was because we don't want to affect the timeline too much we also know that siori isn't going to die yet so uh yeah just just to i i guess that was kind of just to let her know you know hey we care about you siori because i don't think she thinks enough people care about her and love her you know maybe that's all she needed a little, little boost there not all she needed but you know to help well, I think it helped a little, at least. Yeah, exactly. That's exactly what I feel. I hope so. Sometimes people need help, and sometimes they just need some time and space. Yeah, Natsuki, but we know what happens if we give her too much time and space! And I know that their friends are... Or, and, note, and to know that their friends are around if needed. That... true to an extent, for sure. It's hard to find the right balance sometimes. Absolutely true. But usually if you listen to what they're telling you... You'll be on the right track. Yeah, so what's next? I think that's all we have to do here. Let's try a different day. Okay. Interesting. This is going by pretty quick. I, I believe this mod's actually kind of long. So I think there's definitely going to be, like, um, more after this. But, uh, yeah, we're, we're blasting through these days right now. Um, okay. So we did Wednesday, Friday, and technically a schmidge and a Sunday. So I guess let's jump to uh, to Thursday now. I, I don't think us saying, Siori, we care about you. One time is enough to have influence on Sunday yet. So let's jump to Thursday. <clears throat> Monday's a real mixed bag. I'm kind of too scared to go to Monday. Isn't Monday like the death day? I, 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 I don't want to get spooked, man. I don't want to get spooked. We're outside of my house. I hear familiar voices in the distance. One of them is my own. Natsuki grabs my arm and yanks me into the alleyway, where we won't be seen. Tell you what, I really thought that that was going to take a different turn. I thought we were going to say that, like, in vanilla DDLC, Natsuki pulls us to, like, an alleyway and we start making out or something. Holy shit, side lore. We overhear Siori, uh, asking me a pretty awkward question. After that, uh, we go our separate ways. Uh, probably the one, uh, about, like, walking home with Natsuki or her, I think. That would be the question. That was weird. Tell me about it. But, Alec, tell me something. 
When you picked the choice, were you honest? Absolutely. I chose you, Natsuki, because I fucking love you, baby girl. Of course I was. I even told her that it wasn't just about liking someone else. I would have walked home with Siori, but I couldn't just tell her that. I, actually, yeah, yeah, I said I would have walked home with Natsuki. I'm sorry, man. You know, wait, did I? I'm not gonna lie, it's kind of fucked up. I'd walk home with Natsuki sometimes, but also I know that, like, walking home with Siori, that's, like, our special thing, you know? It would just, it would be a give and take, or maybe all three of us would walk home together. I can't just, like, ghost Natsuki, though, when I'm trying to get in her pants, you know what I'm saying? So, like, yeah, I'm gonna walk with her sometimes. I can't tell Siori that I wouldn't walk home with her to her face. Of course I was. I haven't told Siori why I would still walk home with her. Uh, yes. So, so this. I mean, it is about liking someone else, but again, I still want to walk home with Siori sometimes. I think this is what I'm supposed to choose, though. This is a, this is a little convoluted. Sure. Because I, I told her that I'd walk home with Natsuki. But it is totally because I like her. So my answer isn't even really here. <laughs> I guess we're supposed to go with this. Good. She probably would have... Uh... She probably would have been stressed about it no matter what you told her. That, honestly, that's true. Even if we, like, said, no, Siori, it's only you, baby girl. She'd be like, yeah, but, like, you're totally fucking Natsuki on the side, you bitch. You know what I mean? So, like, it's kind of a lose-lose. So you might as well be honest. But I think that she would understand if you were honest, at least. Okay, let's get a move on. All right, cool. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. And, ooh, it, honestly, it's a little bit of a shorter episode, but at this point, I think we're, like, again, we're not getting to the end of the mod, because I believe this mod's, like, a few hours long, and we've only been playing for, like, a half hour. Um, but we're, like, hitting climax here in, like, this, um, oh, I know why. This, this is the, this is the sting operation save Siori, and then we're gonna move to, to the other girls as well. So this is, like, the operation bring back Siori. Oh, this is interesting. Okay, I, I do really like this mod. This is freaking cool. So yeah, these, these are like the climax parts for Siori, which I assume would probably take like another 15 minutes at least. So maybe even more, because again, this is like the climax. This was kind of like information gathering. Now it's like, whoa, shit's about to hit the fan. Because going to Sunday, we're actually going to... Um, if you guys didn't see the other part, we said we didn't love Siori, and our plan was to then chase after Siori and, like, have another in-depth conversation about that with her. So, uh, yeah, I'm very curious as to where that goes. But I think we should leave that for the next episode and knock out Sunday and Monday next part. So, yeah. With that being said, thank you so much for watching, everybody. Um, thank you for tuning in. Like the video if you enjoyed. Comment down below how you felt about the episode, how you feel about me, whatever, whatever. Um, yeah, also... I Something I do definitely want to know, um, I think this probably only matters to the people that are still watching right now. If you want some more videos of, like, me either cosplaying an anime girl or as a girl, if you think it's cool, uh, let me know. If you don't care, then whatever. But, yeah, if, if you want more, let me know. I assume probably just people don't really care. But let me know if you do care. Uh, and yeah, with that being said, um, subscribe if you haven't already, turn on the notification bell so you can get notified when I post a new video, which, spoilers, is every day. We upload daily here, baby, so, like, stay up to date. Be able to click on that notification as soon as the next video drops so you don't miss out. Because sometimes, I'm telling you, the, the subscription box just doesn't work. So, notification bell guarantees you'll get the next video. I, I also live show on Twitch every day. Um, besides Monday and Friday. So if you want more content from me, you can also get it there. Link for my Twitch will be down in the description. Uh, yeah, go follow that if you want more content from me. But with that being said, thank you so much for watching, everybody. Much love, take care, and have a damn good one.